X's top five most versatile players in the game. When I look at the most versatile, yes, a big part of it is playing multiple positions, but also the versatility you bring offensively adds to that equation as well. Let's start with number five, Cattell Marte. He plays the middle of the field, second base, shortstop, center field. His speed is elite and makes all the plays defensively, but his bat is even more valuable than his ability to change gloves. The Diamondbacks were trash last year, and granted, he only played 90 games. He still hit 318 with the OPS plus of 143. That's 43% better than the league average. I don't think he'll be in Arizona too much longer because his stock is continually rising and teams are always looking for the next Chris Taylor, Kike Hernandez type player. Versatility comes naturally to Marte. The number four most versatile player in the game is someone who still doesn't get enough national recognition and mostly because he's playing for a team that's still rebuilding. Whit Merrifield of the Kansas City Royals plays second base and all over the outfield, an all-star in 2019 and this past year. The flexibility he adds to a team is invaluable. Plus, what he lacks in power production, he makes up for his legs with the lost art of stolen bases. He swiped 40 bags last year and hit 42 doubles. He is sure-handed defensively and another guy whose value is highly sought after because of the lack of productive, versatile players. We throw around this term winning player without truly defining what that is. It's a player who glues everything together that you can't replace. A guy whose excellence on the field makes everyone else level up. That's Whit Merrifield, my number three most versatile player in the game. You won't see very many players in our game playing a corner infield position and being able to man center field. Chris Bryant has proven he's capable even in a tough ballpark like San Francisco. He's a superstar in our game and easily could demand a stick at his most natural position, but the selflessness brings a great element to his game every team could use. He's a four-time All-Star, World Series champion, an MVP, and one of the game's most productive players when it comes to both sides of the ball. It's almost hard to believe he's a free agent. Any team who signs him automatically enhances both their offense and defensive flexibility immediately but he's gonna cost a pretty penny being one of the top three hitters available still on the market. The number two most versatile player in the game is really what we call a Swiss army knife or a jack of all trades when it comes to versatility. And that's your guy, Chris Taylor. The thing I love about Chris Taylor is that he's been one of the most versatile players in the league for a perennial contender in the Dodgers for a good period of time now. He's shown the consistency to play all over the field while bringing exceptional offensive production. He has a knack for the big hit and seems to always deliver in the big moment. When you sit and watch a Dodgers game, nothing spectacular is gonna stick out about him visually necessarily. But over the full course of a season, he is as consistent as they come, no matter where he's playing, and he's continuing to get better. And the number one most versatile player in the game right now is Kike Hernandez. Speed, power, defense, passion, energy, big game experience, those all come into play for Kike. He's a special player at the top of the lineup that continues to be a catalyst anywhere he goes. His defense is extremely underrated and borderline gold glove worthy in center field. He laughs at catch probability percentages and we saw what he's capable of doing with the bat when he's hot this past postseason. He's a difference maker and gives amazing balance to a lineup with star-studded power, whether that was in LA or now in Boston. Everyone needs a Kike Hernandez on their team, but there is only one. And there is a reason why more and more teams are searching for or trying to develop a player like Kike. They don't come around very often. Enjoy Kike's game because his versatility is extraordinary. Examine the list and let me know what I missed.